In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I pre-pull my hair with African Pride's pre-shampoo detangling condition product. It has aloe and coconut water. As you can see, it's pretty liquidy, which is good. It helps to hydrate my hair. I also spray some water in my hair just finely, not to get it drenched, so that my hair can be pliable as I put it into sections to apply the product. As you can see, this product is really good with my tangles. First, I finger detangle my hair to get the initial tangles. Then I came in with a little detangling brush. It's, it's a struggle getting that detangling. That's one of the hardest parts of wash day for me. It's the detangling process. But products like African Pride, as well as Nature's Little Secret, are really helpful for me when it comes to detangling. I have other videos telling you guys about the importance of pre-pooing um, in order to help with high growth fatigue. One of the biggest benefits of pre-pooing for me is this detangling process that you're seeing happening right now before I shampoo or cleanse my hair to help not have any further tangles later on in the process. So like I said, it has aloe and coconut water in it, which makes it a bit water more watery than the Nature's Little Secret. Nature's Little Secret has like fenugreek and other great things in there, but um, African Pride is pretty simple and but still gets the job done, as you can see. Getting the back part, which is tends to be the most tangled part of my hair, is a struggle. But like I said, that little brush also help to follow up my finger detangling and make sure I got all of my shed hair out of there. I love to hear from you guys in the comments. What do you guys use to detangle? Big tooth comb? Do you use a brush? Your fingers? What's your primary way of detangling your hair? When you have uh, natural hair, it is very important. That was a game changer for me when I found out how important it is to detangle before I shampoo. And that's a little tip when you're standing and you go side to side that kind of helps with the uh, foot pain that I was experiencing from all of that detangling. I would say the whole process though to detangle my hair took about 20 minutes. Um, that's one of the benefits of having short natural hair. And now for the beer rinse. This beer I used is Budweiser. I believe you could use any brand. I put the beer in a bowl as you can see that red bowl um, I opened the can of Budweiser and I let it go flat so that the alcohol um, could dissipate that helps it to not be as drying in the hair now beer is really great for our gray natural hair because it has uh, wheat protein in it the hops um, that can help strengthen the hair it helps the hair to be shiny it helps it to be soft one of the benefits that I didn't realize that this beer rinse would have, this is my second time doing it, is it helped brighten my gray hair even better than apple cider vinegar. Now that was my experience. You'd have to try it out yourself to see. So I basically used the bowl in order to make sure that all my hair was saturated. So I dunked my head in there first, as you guys saw, and then I took the remainder of the beer and I just put it all over my hair and let it get saturated uh, with that beer. I first used the pre-poo as you guys saw I rinsed that out and then I did this beer rinse and then you're going to see that I'm going to add a conditioner uh, to my hair. So I made sure to just squeeze out the excess so my hair is still saturated with the beer and then I'm going to add the conditioner from Baskin Bloom the Brahmi Root Hair Mask. It's a great um, conditioner that has some Ayurvedic herbs in it. So my hair, like I said, is saturated with the beer and I put the conditioner on top of it. Now, beer can be like a nice gentle protein treatment. And then when I put the conditioner, it helps to add moisture 
um, to give that moisture protein balance. It also can help to take out the smell of the beer. After I finished rinsing out the conditioner, my hair was soft, shiny, and bright, and it did not have any smell of the beer in there. So I'd love for you guys to let me know in the comments any questions that you have. Let me know if you've used a beer rinse before. Um, any, like I said, any questions that you have, I can answer on my next live. But this is definitely going to be a staple in my routine using a beer rinse after I pre-poo. You also can use beer to clarify your hair. So I basically, after putting in the conditioner, used a shower cap and I left it in for about 20 to 25 minutes. And I did not use heat. So like I said, let me know any questions you guys have. This was my hair afterwards. I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.